This is the airport of Frankfurt, Germany. Flight 592 prepares to take off for Cairo and then Ethiopia. Passengers aboard this plane have no idea their lives are about to change forever. And so is mine. William Cruz turns a quiet Palm Bay grocery store into a war zone. After killing two officers in the front, he is now firing out the back. A civilian uses his pickup truck to block his fire and risks his life to save civilians. Cruz then goes back inside. Eight hours into this intense standoff, the plan is. The SWAT team is preparing to fire tear gas into the front of the store, forcing Cruz out the rear door, where a sniper is ready to take the shot. Inside the mini mart, Bennett is hiding behind bulletproof glass. The only way for the snipers to get to him is to fire one bullet through the glass and fire a second bullet through the same hole. That's practically impossible. At the Florida mini mart, 100 police cars and over 200 officers have the place surrounded. News helicopters are covering it from every angle. Another helicopter is bringing in the killer's girlfriend. After reviewing the blueprints, the SWAT team has discovered that on the 10th floor where the hostages are being held, there's a mechanical room just down the hallway, large enough to hold three shooters. It also has access from the roof. The SWAT team now has a sniper in the building. From his position, he has a view of the balcony through an air vent. If the gunman comes out on the balcony, he's going to take the shot. <laughs> 